the woman was stopped by a clown. The clown gestured as if making a phone call, but the woman ignored him and walked away. The smiling clown instantly turned angry. Later, at the platform waiting for the train, she was startled to find the clown sitting next to her, mimicking her every move. Feeling frightened, she stood up to leave. After a few steps, she looked back, only to see the clown still staring at her. She hurried to the next platform, looking around to make sure the clown wasn't following. Taking out an apple, she began to eat. But when she glanced up, the clown was suddenly across from her. Ignoring the clown, she took another bite of the apple, but her hand moved uncontrollably, mimicking the clown's actions. Whatever the clown did next, the woman copied with a smile. The clown turned to watch the approaching train. Then, without warning, he began edging closer to the tracks. The woman found herself unable to resist walking towards the tracks, mirroring the clown's every step until the clown took his final step. The boy takes his pet to school. He wants to get a perfect score on his test. The pet pooped. When the test started, the boy held the poop in his hand. He looked at his classmates' papers, but only one fly was attracted to the poop. Then it was time for the exam. One of his classmates noticed the boy holding a pile of poop. He looked at him in disbelief. Angry, he shoved the pet down the toilet, but the pet gave him more poop. The boy sat down on the floor in dismay. The teacher was angry with him and kept pouring water on him. The next day, the boy went to school. The school bully stopped him and grabbed his bag and saw this strange pet. The bully picked it up. He brought a saw. The boy begged them not to hurt the pet, and the bully took out a drill. The boy got angry and tugged at the bully's shirt, but a fat hand grabbed him. Then a girl told him to let go of the boy, then easily pushed him down. The boy and the bullies were shocked. Then the boy went over to the girl. The girl picked him up, but the teacher found them. Everyone stood in the playground and was punished. The boy's pet came over. He picked it up happily, 